Hi guys, it is Senior Citizen Tuesday. Guess where I went today? Yep, Goodwill. Uh, found a few things, nothing spectacular. Well, one spectacular thing, I thought. So I'm very uh, anxious to share this very small haul with you. But I am also extremely excited about a book that I found for myself on eBay. Uh, hang on, I'm so thirsty. I just ate. Um, when I was showing some books in one of my hauls a couple hauls ago, I was talking about the night before Christmas book that I had as a child and was describing it and everything and uh, right down to the color of the cover and everything. So I found it on eBay and it just came in the mail today and I am so excited. So let me share it with you. This is a wonder book. There's the name there. There's the back. Oh dear, he's, he's peering around, here he comes. So, this was the book I had as a child. Now, if you recall, I mentioned, I had it a little backwards. Santa is on the cover and not the scene that I thought was on the cover, which was, Santa in a living room and a chair and um, a table. And in the bowl on the table were these round, different colored candies. I had it a little mixed up, but I was pretty close. So here's Santa on the front cover. But, okay, this is the first couple pages. But... When we get in here, there's the table with the bowl of round, different color canned candies, the fireplace. Yes. <laughs> I have a good long-term memory. It is my short-term memory that sucks. <laughs> but, like, tell me that that is not a great memory. I used to just sit and look at that bowl of candies and think, wow, I would love to be able to eat those and wondering what kind of candies they were because I had never seen candies like that. They actually look like jawbreakers to me right now, but um, yeah, so, and then here's the sugar plums dancing in the head. And he looked out the window and threw up the sash. Oh, my God, you guys. I am just in heaven right now. This book is fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness. I am just ecstatic. And there he goes, off into the night. And this book was published in 1965. So I was two years old when this book came out. So, yes, I am so excited. So I had to share that with you guys. I knew it, it was coming, but I didn't know how long it was going to be before it came. So, um, Binks, you have to, come on, get down. Hi, what's up? Come on. That's a good boy. Oh, okay. All right, so, um, 
I guess we're just going to get used to this, you know, curved question mark tail always in my face while I'm filming now. Um, so I spent and I just realized because we had some issues at the cash register. I just realized that I did not get my senior discount today. I only received 50% off on purple tag items and I only got one thing. I think it was one, maybe two things that were purple tag. Everything else was regular priced, which I should have got less 25%. So I'm going back tomorrow with my receipts and get my 25%. Uh, anywho, I hate when that happens. He moved my camera. Let me fix it a little bit. All right. So let me start with, I found the mate. Let me, let me get it. Let me just get it real quick. One of my subscribers, my friends, sent me this. If you guys recall, this adorable little kitty tea light holder. I found the mate today. Yes, I did. I got him along with this guy as a pair. I got both for $3.39, but it was supposed to be less 25%. So, yes. So now I have all three to go together. I'm like so excited. Yes. So then I found this um, mug. It was uh, 89 cents. And I happen to know someone that lives um, here in uh, San Francisco. And it's really cool because it has like all the different sites. I don't know much about San Francisco other than they have like the cable cars and stuff. So I thought that was really cool. So I grabbed it. Then um, they had these in a plastic Ziploc bag for $5.49 purple tag. So it was half price, so $2.25. And I got these two vintage. Santa's. This one says Japan. This one doesn't say anything on the back. You could see Japan here written in the, uh, it's like uh, it was pressed into the clay or ceramic. But look at that. He's awesome. And this one is too. So it was these two items in the bag along with these two votive candle holders, which I don't really care about. I'll probably just redonate them. I just wanted the two Santas. <laughs> so I got that. And actually, I'm thinking, was this an ashtray? Because look at it. It's got a... Ah! Thanks! You got to go! Go! Get down! It has a groove here. So I'm thinking this was an ashtray. Who would use this cute Santa to put cigarette ashes in? Oh my God. No way. Oh my God. This camera is keeps getting moved. Um, then I found this beautiful candy dish. The cranberry glass and clear. It's gorgeous. Binks, would you? Can you hear that? He has his paw inside of this thing that's in front of me because it has a string and he thinks he can get it. So he's trying to get it with his paw. Excuse me for a second, guys. Oh, 
Oh my <laughs> word, just to try to film a video is like a federal case. <sighs> Look, I've been up since five. It is now uh, 7.30 in the evening. I'm not trying to play with Binks right now while I'm trying to film a video. I am sorry. I am tired. <sighs> he will get to spend a lot of time with me in about 15 minutes when I put my pajamas on and crawl in the bed. He'll be right up to here on me <laughs> every night. So, anyways. <laughs> So I got this gorgeous candy dish. Look at the pattern on the bottom of that. Isn't that beautiful? It's just gorgeous. And it's in really excellent condition. It does have just a couple little teeny like flea bites um, on the inside of the lid. There's just like a couple. There's like one here. I could feel them when I run my finger. One little teeny here, but like nothing major. And you can't even see it when the lid's on. You can barely see them when you're looking at it. So this is just gorgeous. This might have been a half price. I can't remember. I spent a total of $17.15. And it should have been probably more like $15. But, you know, like I said, they forgot my senior discount. So... Oh, Lordy, I went to Subway. Drinking my delicious raspberry fused lemonade. Oh my God, it's so good. Oh. And the last fabulous item that I got, which he was trying to get the string out of, is this gorgeous Fitz and Floyd. Look at this, you guys. I'm assuming it's some type of a candy dish, cookie plate. Look at that. It's in excellent condition. No chips, no cracks. Look at it's got this came somebody bought it at the Goodwill. That's a Goodwill sticker for $6.99. I got it for $5.49 less 25%, so like four something. But um I think this is absolutely gorgeous. I have no idea what I can get for this. I haven't researched it yet, but it is going to be up for sale in my eBay shop. Um, I just listed a whole bunch of stuff and I'm still listing. So, um, yeah, you know, it's a work in progress, <laughs> but I really thought this was spectacular and it was way up on a top shelf and I just happened to see the top of Santa peeking out. I'm like, Oh, what's that? And I pulled it down and I looked at it and turned it over and I said, Oh, I will take you home. Thank you. So, <sighs> Get the Binks hairs off of it. Yeah. So let me know what you guys think about this. I just, I, I'm going to have a hard time selling it because I think it's gorgeous. But so that is it for my small haul. Uh, tomorrow is the drawing for the 5,000 subscriber giveaway. I will be giving away the aluminum tree that I spoke about and a box of some vintage goodies. So I want to say good luck to everyone. All of your comments must be in by 12 o'clock midnight tonight, Eastern Standard Time. Tomorrow evening, I will draw, I won't draw, the random number picker will pick, um, a number and whoever's name is next to that number will be the winner. I have over 200 comments. Uh, I think I'm at like two, 
maybe 230 comments so far. So, um, the random comment picker, you will pick a number between one and however many comments, and it'll just pick a random number, and that'll be the winner. So, good luck to everyone. I'm very excited to see who wins. Um, I do have a piece of friend mail that I wanted to share with everyone. Um, my buddy Larry, I love him dearly. He sent me another package. So I'm going to go grab it and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. And um, before I share um, what is in this package that Larry sent me, let me lower this down a little bit. I feel like I'm like, there we go. Um, I wanted to um, just say to everyone, my daughter um, did a huge purge this weekend. She had 22 bins in the basement of her stuff. <laughs> uh, just collections of Disney and this stuff and that stuff and just tons and tons of stuff. And um, she got rid of a lot. Uh, we took two carloads over to Holy Trinity to donate. I took a big bag of blankets to my nursing home along with a huge bag of stuffed animals. So she asked me to um, say to all of my friends, um, although she really, really appreciates when um, you all think of her and send her um, Disney items and stuff like that, she is going to gracefully decline any further gifts because she doesn't have the room for them. And um, she is going to be getting married and is going to have to move everything from here to wherever they're going to live because they haven't um, gotten a house yet. So um, she wanted me to say how much she really, really appreciates all of you thinking of her. But she asked if um, no more gifts would be sent to her because she just doesn't have the room to store them right now. So um, she feels really bad and she doesn't want anyone to think that she doesn't appreciate it. And I said, no, they'll understand, you know. So um, anywho, <laughs> on that note, um, let me say how much I appreciate all of you thinking of my daughter. Um, however, <laughs> my son loves horror stuff. So if you guys have any horror stuff you want to get rid of, you could send it my way and I'll hand it over to him. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding, guys. I just don't want any, anyone to think that I don't think about my son because I don't know. I do. And he doesn't like normal things. So <laughs> I don't know. But anyway. <laughs> so let's get into this package that Larry sent me. I have opened it up, taken out the bubble wrap, and I'm going to try to pick in here. Oh, look, he sent me ice cream. I think I'm going to have to refreeze it. <laughs> oh, and it's Neapolitan. That's perfect. Especially if you don't know what kind the person likes. All right, so let's see what we have here. at this it says brains brains okay would you like me to add brains to your shopping cart <laughs> oh shoebox greeting cards they were the best hope you get whatever you asked for on halloween hi d like um like the items enclosed youtube buddy larry <laughs> oh binks he's back again there goes the camera he just doesn't take no for an answer. All right. I guess we'll start with this item here that's packed in some blue foam. Oh, 
Okay, I think I'll just cut this tape. I should have brought some scissors, but I did not, so we'll use my little straight edge. Cut through the tape. All right. I've got it. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. Larry, look at this guy. Oh, wow. Oh, he is fantastic. Look at it standing there all proud with his chest stuck out. Just like a man. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. I'm definitely going to have to add a second shelf for my roosters. That is fabulous. <laughs> All right, what do we have in here? This has lots of tape. So I sent Larry a package, and he liked everything that I had sent, so that was cool. Anytime I find little frog things, I can't help but send them to him. He has, a, you guys wouldn't believe the collection, collections that Larry has in his home. He sent me pictures of all of his different collections, and they're just amazing. He doesn't collect just frogs. He, he has several collections. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> oh, my God. This is awesome. A Kung Fu rooster. <laughs> oh my God. Look at this guy. He is awesome. Oh my word. Larry, you have the best sense of humor ever. I'm telling you. You crack me up. Oh, my word. That was great. <laughs> Throw that in my oh, poop. <laughs> I'm going to get demonetized. <laughs> I'll have to cut the head out. <laughs> Maybe they didn't hear me. <laughs> Oh, dear. Okay, now hang on, because this has a second piece. <laughs> oh, my God. shaker guys <laughs> this is awesome oh my goodness that is fabulous <laughs> oh my god <laughs> I'm afraid to open the rest of this stuff I might have to take a pee break <laughs> Oh, dear. Oh, Larry, you are something else, buddy. <laughs> oh, let's see what's in the ice cream container. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> he writes, yum, yum. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is like the best part of having a YouTube channel is just the laughter that I get from all of you and some of your comments are so funny. I mean, it's just, it makes my day. Honest to God. 
Banks, are you back again? I know. What do you want? Hi. <laughs> Hi. Can I finish opening this, please, so this video's not an hour long? Do you think? Don't knock the camera, please. Are you going to say hi to everyone? You know you're a camera hog, right? Oh my gosh, look at this candle holder. It's a piggy. Oh my goodness. I have a clear glass one like this that's a cat and it was Avon. Is this Avon? Nope, I don't think so. Oh my gosh, how adorable is that? Look at that little tail. <laughs> oh my God, Larry. I cannot thank you enough, my friend. I, I just, I just love you to death. I, you know, I really hope that we can meet someday. I was, he, you know, He's like 500 miles away from my aunt and uncle. And I don't drive on the thruway here. So there's like no way I would ever take my life in my own hands and drive in California on the thruway, okay? No, not happening. But uh, it would be nice <laughs> to, to be able to meet you, Larry, because I think we would have a blast thrifting together and have a couple cocktails or coffee or tea or whatever, you know, you never know. You just never know. Um, thank you so much. You really made my day. I, I just, <laughs> I, love, I just love this is awesome. And this guy, <laughs> it's just too much. Oh my word. This is just great. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the friend mail as much as I did. Oh, my word. It was just great. And um, like I said, good luck to all of you who entered the giveaway. And uh, I will see you tomorrow when I draw the winner. So please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys. <laughs>